Can we? Happy New Year. <laughs> Let's get that out of the way first. Anyway. Can we talk about this? Now, though 2016 was a year ridden with tragedy, there were a few good things to come out of it. I mean, Camille was released, and she's thick AF, so that's good. Splash Arts got updated, and, uh... Uh... That's it. Well, let's get started naming the things we hated. The tank meta sucked. And I'm not saying that last season was the only season in which tanks were relevant, but it was definitely a bigger issue. The worst part was after the Sunfire and Frozen Fist buff, that was all tanks needed to scale in the late game. The fact that a character can take more damage than a tank, and still be able to deal more damage than a... A tank was... Oh, that's why they call him that. Well, it was bonkers. The idea that defense items can give you offense and wave clear doesn't make sense. Defense shouldn't scale with offense. They're opposites. That's the equivalent of giving someone a riot shield that also kicks you in the dick. Do you see that? Do you see how overpowered that is? I should... I should patent this. I understand this was all implemented to counter the rough ADC meta that took over in the preseason, but holy shit, dial it back, guys. It's like a kid made fun of your haircut, so you made fun of their dead mom. Chill. Way to bring a fist to a... a gunfight? I don't know. Now, the obvious approach would have been to balance the two classes so that these goofballs can coexist. But how about no? How about we add an entire different beast? The mage rework. <laughs> Boy. Sure smells like a bunch of asses about to get whooped. I wish I could talk about this in past tense, but I'm sure I speak for everyone when I say this is still a problem. But lucky for us, not all of them are. Vlad, Swain, and Anivia have notably fallen off, but don't you worry, because that gaping hole was filled with even bigger fucking problems. Sindra can point and click murder your ADC in front of his mother with the press of a button. And Ziggs? Oh! Oh, Ziggs can one-shot turrets! You know, these things that we go to for safety? Nope! Not anymore! And the list goes on and on! Supports went from being loving mothers to ruthless killers that don't need a bitch AD carry to get to late game. And now top laners are... Well, they're the same, to be honest. Nothing really important happened because they were never fixed! And before they could even get to balancing this, they flipped the script on us again. With the mages now shitting on everything in every angle possible, we all thought, Man, there's nothing they could do right now to override this. And you know what? We were absolutely fucking right! Oh, that's the wrong sound. There we go. The assassin rework sucked. And that makes me salty because that was the only rework I was looking forward to. And if you want more detail about that, I'll link a video at the end. But TLDR, it was awful and incredibly unbalanced. Look at Talon. I mean, look at him. What did he do to deserve this? Why does his mobility spell start with a 2 minute and 40 second cooldown per wall? It's so fucking bad. And it doesn't even deal damage. At least make it charge based or something. Now as much as I want to continue to be mean about League of Legends last year, I can't be. Sure, they ruin events sometimes, and their characters have never been balanced, but the amount of time and energy Riot puts into this game and into esports in general is ridiculous. I love League of Legends, and because of it I've met so many people and have done so many amazing things. A lot of my closest friends and I met because of this amazing game, and I can't be more grateful. Riot has given me so much, and as much as I like to dick around about the tiny things, I just wanted to say thank you. For giving us all a way to connect and giving me so many new opportunities that I didn't think were possible. Now go fix fucking talent! Thank you for watching this week's episode of Can We Talk About This? If there's something else you want to talk about, leave it in the comment section below and I'll be sure to get to it because we're best friends and that's all that matters. Also, Magikarp used fly, if you're watching this, or, or any of you guys that came from him, thank you so much. I was blown away. I, I literally was frozen in front of my computer for hours and couldn't even edit because I was so shocked at what was happening. Ah! I don't want to sound like too much of a bitch here. But thank you, Matt Castro. You're awesome. And welcome all my new friends. I am so excited to make you guys more content. Whew, had to get that out of the way. Now, uh... What are you wearing? <laughs>